ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पाक टेक यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू यूज एन एन पी एन ट्रांजिस्टर विद इन दी सर्किट विजिट ऑफलाइन सिमुलेटर सो फॉर इट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू क्लिक ऑन फाइल एंड देन न्यू देन यू नीड टू क्लिक ऑन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स प्रोजेक्ट एंड प्रेस ओके here on right side you can see this gallery option so click on it and we have to search for our transistor so we will go down and here it is written transistors so we will take our npn transistor which is obviously a bjt that is bipolar junction transistor now is we are using this transistor as a switch for it we need one battery or power supply and one switch switches so we will make this thing so it is our push switch so rotate it out okay or like this okay now after it we need one resistor in order to give a signal on the base of the bjt so go and take your resistor so 1k is enough for us okay now this and this okay now connect this a meter of the transistor with the uh, negative supply of the battery one and the last thing which you need to do is to attach an led to see the what we can say is the output to see the output that either transistor used to switch or not so we will go for our light emitting diodes and led okay now Okay now this our complete circuit okay now you you can see that uh, what's the basic principle of this circuit whenever we are giving any sort of signal on base that is positive even if it is like in some cases even if it is in uh, millivolts or microvolts but still transistor used to work so whenever we will give a signal with the help of this push button switch okay on the base then the collector and emitter of the transistor will behave as a short circuit will behave as not perfectly short circuit because uh, there is some resistance between collector and emitter but it will uh, but it can behave as a we can assume okay we can assume that it is a bit like short circuit so then our diode led will illuminate out okay so so it will show some sort of illumination so we will see that our transistor has switched so now we will run it now we can see that whenever there is nothing on the base or no signal on the base then our led is off whenever we we will press the switch the base of the transistor will get the signal and then our led will be on so in this way we can use our transistor as a switch within the circuit wizard so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe